Do you want to learn how you can host your static website on Google Drive? So in this video, we are going to cover how you can host your static web page on Google Drive. Myself, Nilesh Radhagi, and you're watching Tiki Programmer, and let's get started with this tutorial. First of all, let me open up my browser. So I will be using Safari here. And then what you can do is search for DRV, DRW, dot I guess TRV dot TW okay uh, so you need to just visit D you can just see here DRV dot TW and here you can host your like host on Google Drive and host on Microsoft OneDrive so we will be hosting using Google Drive so let me just open up my drive here so just type Google Drive and cloud storage okay go to drive okay so make sure you have logged in with the same account that you are going to log in here so i'm logged in with already logged in with my the account that i want so i'll be just going here and then host on google drive and then you need to select the account i've just selected this account you just need to give the permissions okay then now choose and you are logged in here so it says you were we were unable to like discover any html pages so now what we're going to do is go back to our drive and hit on new new folder and let me just rename it as techie web site okay and hit on create so now this folder has been created you just need to click on here share and Make sure you change it to everyone and hit got it and done. So now your file or the folder is now publicly shared. So now what we need to do is open up this folder and now we are going to paste our HTML document here. So what I'll do is here I have a HTML code. And so I hope you can write this code. Uh, this is just a hello world program. So let me just change it to This is T C H I P R O G R A M M R website. Okay, so now what I'll do is I'll just save this, go back. Uh, let me just navigate to this file, open in Finder. So I have this index.html file here. I will just rename this as site.html. You can just keep it anything. Uh, I will just, for my convenience, I will just. I'm just keeping it as site.html. Now what you need to do is just drag it. Okay, not this. We just need to drag this file and paste it here. So now it says uploading. Let's just wait. As we have now like uh, uploaded it in a shared folder and the, so automatically the files that are within the shared folder are automatically as a shared desktop so here you can see the people icon here so now your website or whatever the html file is so make sure that that is dot html it has an extension called dot html else it wouldn't be recognized so now our this thing the tech web techie website and which has a site dot html are both public make sure that are public else the, that won't be indexed then let's go back to the admin dot console and let me just refresh this and let me log in with the same ID. Make sure the ID you are logging in is equal or same to the drive. So now here you can see it has just indexed something called techie website site.html. This is what we were expecting because we have placed it here. Okay. So now what I can do is I can just click on this link. And here you see this is a techie programmer's website. Now what we can do is we can just copy this link and we can share this link anywhere we want. But I would recommend you to go with URL shorteners. So you can just do it as URL shortners. You can use bit.ly or anything. So yeah, it's recommending us the URL shortener. So just go here, shorten your link, just paste it, shorten. Okay, so here we have our, our shorten link. Let me just try this paste this is the small link enter 
and here you can see this is a technical programmer's website so this is how we can host a static web page on our google drive so basically you can like you can do some stuff which you want to host uh, maybe you can even run the javascript even because that falls under static stuff but uh, you cannot run something like .php files or something like database management it's like which are really connected to database so you can just run static files with animation etc so that's it for today uh, i hope you enjoyed this video make sure you leave a comment and save it and share it and if you're new make sure you hit follow until then take care